Alright guys, so today I'm an hour and 20 minutes from home and we're going gold panning. Let me see if we can get some gold. See down at the creek. Sketchy walking down this hillside. Got my pans and then my bucket. But a few other members of the club are going to be here. And that's how I found out about here. So if they want to be on film, you'll see them too. So yeah, I'm going to just wait for them for a little bit. Might do a little test pan. This is definitely the right kind of rock. See these big, big rocks. There's red mixed in. There's black ones. So, looks decent. Guys, we actually have a little tiny piece of flower gold in here. It's not mica. It's definitely gold. Because it's not really flying around. You guys won't be able to see it, but you got to believe me. So, we're going to walk up. And uh, meet with them up here. And uh, that was a false alarm. I had a, I thought it was flower gold, but it was just something else. It wasn't mica. It was like stuck in my pan. Just a piece of quartz. That's a dead frog. Never mind. Guys, right, so we're gonna walk up. We're just heading up the creek bank here to this rock wall. A little slippery. hard to see because the glare but there's a smaller piece of gold there and then flower up at the top of the black sands but you'll be seeing a lot of this today we're gonna take out this rock wash it off lots of flower gold in that pan guys you can't see it I'm not even gonna bother but that tops all flower there's a glacial rock guys that's the one I just did. Got a lot of dirt off. Yeah, that is a nice one though. Right at the top there. Dead center of the camera. That's a little little uh, flower gold piece. Alright. What do you got in the pan? That is... Yeah. In case you can't see it, you guys can see it. Right there. It's a nice little picker. You gotta pick it up on camera. First try. That's a picker, guys. Awesome. Here's what's in Ray's cleanup from, how much was that? Three buckets. Three, Three five buckets. a gallon buckets. That's pretty good, guys. Especially for PA. That's. Blair's being annoying, but you can definitely see the yellow. I can see a lot more pieces than you guys can, but it's all over the place. Well, I'm now way up the creek here, and I'm looking for arrowheads or just any kind of artifact. So, see if we can find anything. Well, no artifacts down there. Uh, just a lot of walking. I did three test pans uh, looking for other spots of gold and each of them had a piece of flower gold. Well two of them did. Two of them had a piece and the one actually had two pieces. So I'm just walking back now. We'll start panning. Another little piece of flower gold dead center of the camera. Get that sucked up. All over this black sand. There's gold all over. Well, got my mini sluice here. It's gonna hold a lot of gravel. I just thought it'd be funny to use it. All right, I'm still filling up the mini sluice. Got this bucket full of dirt. Just took it out from under that boulder. Just gonna keep putting it through. There's turkeys across the creek. It's about 13, 14 of them. 
They're coming down the bank. I'm just sitting here. I'm dirt. A lot of work, guys. Just got that little glacial till rock or boulder, whatever, pulled out of there. Sifted it all down into this bucket. And right over there's our sluice. I'm just straight up scooping sludge, guys. So pretty much a sluice like this, it just catches gold. That's what it is. Get it to where there's current moving through. Obviously I'm very new at this, but I've had this, my mom got it for me a while ago. There was a cardinal sitting over there. It's a nice sitting, but my back is killing me at this point. I'm gonna get through this bucket and then try to keep going after that. Getting the bottom of this bucket out. This is three quarters of a five gallon bucket worth of work. So we're gonna see what we got. I can see black sand trapped right here, big pocket. So we'll take this apart and see if there's any gold. So I'm starting the panning process here. Look at all this black sand. Half the pan is black sand, but it's still thick and I can already see a piece of gold. So let's, this isn't the finishing pan, you know. So some of this gold I'm gonna let fly back down and I'll just repan this. But I wanna see what we got in here. I can see a flake there that just went down. Is that gold? No. I'm seeing some flakes, or not flakes, uh, uh, whatever you call it, flower gold. Just kinda taking my time. Like I said, I gotta repan this. I'm letting some of the gold go down so I can just get an idea of what's in here. Okay, there's another one. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, look at that. Got ourselves a little, definitely not a picker, but you guys can see it. It's a little stringy piece of gold. See if there's any more up there. Yep, there's more gold. One piece, two piece, three, four, five yeah I'd say there's about ten pieces in here and we got this little one that one's not bad so right on the tip of my thumb there so that's cool um, I'm gonna just repan this, take my time, slowly suck some of it up, and then I'm gonna even save everything in this pan. I'm not tipping none of this. I ain't a quitter, I still got a light. I'm getting this back in the water. Gonna fill that bucket up halfway. We're gonna run it through. My back is killing me, but I'm not giving up. Oh, let's sluice this out. Okay, the bucket is completely empty. Another at least half of a bucket ran through my mini uh, sluice. Let's see how it pans out. Lots of black sand. That's for sure. Okay, I just seen a piece of gold. There's definitely gold, no big pieces though. A piece there. Yeah, not much. 
Nighttime is made for driving, I guess. I'm doing another one. Well, this is probably for sure the last, at least, uh, bucket. This is the top inch is sludge, but the rest is just solid. So let's see. Let's see. Give me luck. guys are right here. The mom's stressing out. Oh, he's coming up. Uh, your mom is stressing out, buddy. You better get down there. This would have looked a lot better with something on top, but it's a lot of black sand, which means there's a good chance for some gold. This is definitely the last uh, sluice run. I'm physically like done in and uh, it's almost dark. So don't mean I'm not gonna pan a little bit more after, but let's clean this up. Come on, one more, you know, highly visible gold piece. That's all I want. Well, pretty much two little oh they're back look what what is it I don't have any bread anywhere so sorry but here's the black sand what are you guys doing here's the black sand and there's a big sinker in there and three or four little sinkers so I'm gonna bottle up all the black sands. This isn't all of it. Uh, there's more down there in that pan. So I'm gonna get all the black sands together. Then we're gonna go ahead and see the final results with the snuffer bottle. Are you eating mussels or what are you eating? I don't know what they're eating. We're eating stuff. I don't know what. I didn't do the best job of panning this, but as you can see, you can see that little bit of yellow, the top there, dead center of the camera once again. And there's a bunch of little pieces to the right of it. So, not bad. All right guys, I'm just making sure I got everything. Uh, I did my best on cleaning up the gold. It's not a lot at all but you know for pennsylvania it's decent so we'll have to i don't know if it'll be in this video or what but it's in that snuffer it's not much so if i don't show it don't worry about it but we found that little tiny strand of it so that was cool but hope you guys enjoyed here's some black sands i gotta sort out and i'm not sure if we can see gold probably not no we can't so I hope you guys enjoyed I'll be gold panning some other time like I said it's a little bit of a drive to get here so I'm glad I did but I am worn out and I haven't eaten today so I'm gonna go home and eat and I hope you guys enjoyed I might show gold at the end I might not so thanks for watching guys